So what we're doing is we're taking a TRD premium off-road and we're adding the Magnuson Supercharger, which will take uh, the horsepower from a standard 4Runner 270 horsepower to a 351 horsepower. And then the torque spec standard is 278 torque. It's going to bring it up to 356 foot-pounds of torque on this engine. So um, if there is anything unique we're doing to this is obviously taking a custom build 4Runner and adding a supercharger doesn't void the warranty. As long as you have it installed by an ASE mechanic, you're still gonna have a three year, 36,000 mile warranty on the supercharger, which doesn't compromise the powertrain warranty of a five year, 60,000 for the Toyota. A couple reasons why I'm taking the front bumper cover off is one is to easier access the front of the vehicle to add the cooler and the second is is to prevent from any damage because you are basically leaning over the front bumper the entire time that you're doing this process. What I'm doing now is I'm connecting the Magnuson programmer to the vehicle. I'm going to pull the OE calibration, ECU calibration, out of the vehicle. I'm going to send it to Magnuson. They will remap it to their performance program and then send it back to me and then I will upload it back to the vehicle. updated thermostat housing for clearance of the drive belt that's going to be running the supercharger it moves everything out a little bit further than the factory position Kendall, let's start something great 